the first time that our work, that my work as a photographer, is exposed in uh, in, for in a foreign country, in a real gallery. I have a bachelor in cultural history and I have masters in uh, journalism, in analytical journalism. But uh, I realized that actually my roots are more into visual culture when I had this pause, when I was having a baby. So I had time to think about my goals in life. I decided once again to roll up to, to school, to educational training school, vocational training school. Which is what we call lifelong learning. Yes. Uh, any chance of uh, making this your profession? Well, I'm trying to switch it because now I'm working as a communication expert in an international school in Vilnius. Uh, so I'm already using photography in my work a lot. But uh, yes, I'm trying, I will be trying to, to make it my, um, my main profession, my main job. Now, Evelina, uh, can you tell us a little bit about your story? Uh, how did you uh, come to study photography? Photography is a very interesting I always loved photography, but after high school, when I had to choose studies, I had this idea to go very high, to make my career in, uh, have a doctorship in veterinary studies. And after finishing master's degree, I still had this idea of photography in my mind, and it still interested me a lot, so I decided to enroll to vocational training school. I was studying art in Fine Arts Academy in Lithuania, and I finished my master and bachelor degree there. And photography was, I guess, for next to me, like for seven years, I guess. And yeah, I had no technical basis, no technical skills, that was some kind of hobby I had. And then I decided that I've got my job, I've got an idea that I want to do something else, something else for myself, probably in a better way, in a professional way, and I need those skills. And the photos that you presented uh, and submitted to the award were part of your work uh, in the school. Yeah, that's right. Uh, we had a first practice that was held um, outside the school, and that was a trip to Curonian Split in Lithuania, picturesque view over there. And yeah, we had an opportunity to work for one week, both digital cameras and an analog photography. And uh, yeah, when we came up with the result, there was an idea just to put it in a, some kind of a collage technique mm -hmm. to represent our teamwork. How about you, Agle? My first studies was like um, 10 years ago, so it was like German uh, philology. And after that, I started to work uh, in other um, city of Lithuania. I was a manager of ice uh, arena. So uh, my work was like 10 years. And after that, uh, I got married and I moved to Vilnius. Uh, and it was a new start start for me. Before about six years, uh, photography was like my hobby. Uh, I was like traveling around the world or in my country, I was taking pictures and all my family, all, all my friends told me that I should try. You entered the competition and you won. Uh, how has your experience been? That's a marvelous achievement for the first year of education and when you see the result of teamwork that, that's, that's cool. You uh, announced it to them that uh, there was a competition. The group we got was the, the best. <laughs> they really they worked together really nice and uh, uh, each of them made the series of the photo photos and we, we talked together which ones to choose and it was really a lot of discussion. And I think the wonderful, it was wonderful teamwork. Is this the end of the road for you in terms of studying and learning? This moment we are uh, we thinking, thinking about uh, new projects. No matter what we will do uh, for the job, we will go that journey. I don't know, together separated, but we will go.